Tonight, a Canadian woman is lashing out for getting kicked off a flight because of her testy two-year-old. It happened at SFO. Night Beats' Mark Sayre is live for us tonight at the airport. Mark? Well, Veronica, the airline is saying one thing, but passengers who are actually on that plane are telling a very different story about what happened here on the tarmac at SFO. Sarah Blackwood is a musician with the Canadian band Walk Off the Earth. She is currently seven months pregnant and boarded a United Express flight to Vancouver with her two-year-old son. He was just having a having a fussy day. He was crying. He was he was loud. He was kind of squirming in my arms. She told the CBC in Canada what happened next. And then they turned the plane around, went back to the gate, and asked me to leave the plane after he was fully sleeping on me. Blackwood tweeted, just got kicked off a flight because my son was crying really loud. And later, apparently my little two-year-old crying son was a big threat to United. My two-year-old, a threat, kicked us off the plane. In a statement, SkyWest Airlines, which operated the flight under the United banner, says, despite numerous requests, the child was not seated and was repeatedly in the aisle of the aircraft before departure and during taxi. The crew made the appropriate decision to return to the gate in the interest of safety. But other passengers on the flight did not see it that way. Passenger Shane Finley called the situation appalling. And passenger Paul Moore said in a posting to United, everyone on that flight was shocked at how unprofessional, unreasonable, and insensitive a certain member of your staff acted. I just felt really, I was embarrassed that we were getting thrown off of an airplane because my son was being fussy. Now, Blackwood did get on a later flight to Vancouver, but she said it turned what was supposed to be a five-hour travel day into a 12-hour travel ordeal, but the airline tonight is offering no apologies. Reporting live at SFO on the Night Beat, I'm Mark Sayer. 